Hey guys, and it's time to spill the beans. The secrets are here regarding the Galaxy Note 20. The features that will collectively make the next big thing from Samsung even more exciting. So we'll start off with the Samsung patent that shows off different ways on how the punch hole can display different indicators. This already happens when you switch to front camera or use facial scanner. The punch hole has this indicator on the sides that kind of highlight that, but now the patent describes that it could be implemented to more things around the UI. So this could happen on the Galaxy Note 20 and of course this might eventually come to the older Samsung devices. Also Ross Young has recently revealed more secrets regarding the Note 20. He actually gave a full interview to Greggles TV so shout out to his channel. You can check out the whole thing. The link is in the description. He basically talks about several key Galaxy Note 20 features. So first up is the Sonic Max fingerprint scanner. You guys remember that Qualcomm showed off their Sonic Max fingerprint scanner that allows for multiple fingers to be registered as well as providing a larger fingerprint scanner area. This technology was first expected to be implemented with the Galaxy S20 family but of course that didn't happen. But now Ross Young claims that this could actually happen with the Note 20 family. This will definitely fix all the issues that we have faced regarding the slow speed of ultrasonic scanner on the Galaxy S20 Ultra. In addition to the faster speed, it also gives you a larger scanner area so you don't have to put your finger at the right spot. He also mentions that the battery in the Note 20 family will start with 4000 mAh all the way up to 5000. 4000 mAh battery size is something that is already leaked for the Galaxy Note 20 and for the Note 20 Plus model we could see a 5000 mAh cell. Samsung has to do this at least for the Plus model because we're gonna see the 120Hz display along with the LTPO technology. Once again this technology will be specific to the Note 20 Plus. It will provide that intelligent refresh rate to conserve battery. So Note 20 Plus could be the best battery performer with the 120Hz refresh rate. Now with the Galaxy Note 20 family, it seems like Samsung is about to raise the bar even higher when it comes to the standard RAM size. According to Ross Young, 16GB of RAM could be the base RAM storage for the Galaxy Note 20 family, which is absolutely insane. Samsung might possibly put its fastest RAM storage on the Note 20 family. We kind of discussed this a while ago that Samsung will mass produce this RAM in the second half possibly for the Fold 2 and the Note 20 family. I have to say Ross Young has done a great job with this information. He's the CEO of Display Supply Chain so all the info he has leaked has to be pretty damn accurate. Now Ice Universe is back again with a leak of a distant future. He says that Samsung is working on a 50 megapixel 1 by 1.3 inch sensor. This is a little bit bigger than the sensor we have on the Galaxy S20 Ultra but slightly smaller than the Huawei P40 Pro sensor. Now this is pretty interesting because Samsung is also working on a 150 megapixel sensor but that is for Xiaomi at the moment so this sensor that IS Universe is mentioning could actually be for Samsung's own next flagship. As always megapixels are nothing Samsung has to bring the software game to the next level and most importantly fix all the issues that we have seen with the S20 Ultra. We have heard that Samsung is dropping the laser autofocus from its camera sensor. They're definitely going to bring something better and make sure the camera is is on that level, not half-baked. Perhaps they can hire Levoy, the man behind the Pixel camera who left Google a couple of months ago. I mentioned this in my previous video that this is the opportunity for Samsung and a lot of you also agree with this decision. If I was at Samsung, I would definitely hire him ASAP. I hope Samsung pulls the trigger and hire him because I'm sure other companies would want to do the same thing. So a big Galaxy Note 20 news day. Let me know in the comment section which feature sounds the most exciting exciting. Don't forget to vote in the poll section and as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.